had to give up. Hey, tell her her. Tell her her. You, that's fun. Oh, man, I wish I was here for that. Yeah, I had tell to give up so theory. much free candy. Girls are crazy <coughs> when it comes to relationships. You can be the coolest girl in the world and hang out with guys and play video games with them, but once you get into a relationship with them, this little gene goes off, and it's every single girl that makes you start thinking and thinking about them and thinking about them and then you become obsessed with them. Well, not obsessed, but like you become crazy. I know, you know I what did I mean? that with my daughter's father. See? I was fucking nuts with him. See? He would actually hide girls up in you, his bedroom. I'm you wonder why he's not texting you. What could he possibly do in that he's not texting you? <laughs> why isn't he over at okay, your house right your now? version of the story is sort of crazy. Did you even hear what she said? Yes, I heard what she said. <laughs> But still, you know what I mean? Hiding it's a girls gene. in his room, kicking down the door, beating the fuck yeah. out of them. Okay. But I ended up breaking up with him, though. Okay. I stayed with him because I Good thing Battery is going to, you know, press charges or something. <laughs> so. I used to beat him up, too. He was a big-ass dude. Like, he kicked my dog one time, so I punched him in the mouth, busted up his lip. He held, choked, held me against the wall, spitting his blood on me. It was crazy. Hard to believe you didn't marry that guy. <laughs> No. So you got his name tattooed on your body somewhere? No. I'll never get a dude's name tattooed on me. I would never do that. That's crazy. But crazy girls would. No kidding. You know the other way you can tell if a girl's crazy? What? When she starts listening to the radio and thinks all the songs are really about you or her. Oh, or too. She just listens to Taylor Swift. <laughs> Taylor Swift wrote a CD just about me. Like... I believe he's from Double for CD. It's my life. It's like she just zoned in on my life. And <laughs> wow. I, I'm wow. just kidding. <laughs> I don't know for sure. I mean, she... And this is why I don't date, because I'm scared to be crazy. Oh, no, you're... Okay. You got the it down, I like would think. Hmm? The guy had you like that, too? He Let's was be, like that towards me, too. Let's and then be I clear. didn't realize guy, it. Had you like that? Had you like that? Really? Come on. I had him like that, and he had me like that, and it just got really bad. Maybe the and two of you could have had matching medication. I finally did. She realized. really do that 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 whole house of love yeah. thing with the beat and the. Dude. Wow, that's frightening. <laughs> I thought you were sort of shy. No, Flavor of love, that's no, it. No, when charm I was with school. Him, I was a bitch. If people would come up to See, my house, I want them there. Do people ever ask you or tell you that you remind we're them like of that Chihuahua. girl on Charm School? No. That MTV show. We're like dogs. Do you know what I'm talking about? No, I don't watch Charms. Though. Okay, just checking. Not crazy. What's she look like? I watched Jersey Shore. She looked a little like you. Except Bye guys. she was... Bye. I, I don't even know. <laughs> I'm still bothered by the whole spit his blood out on me and... Um, I what? know. You know yeah, that's an interesting thing to walk in on. Oh, it's you under some kinky stuff, Knight. <laughs> One of these days, I'm gonna get, a, I'm gonna have you tortured until you talk. You, you know, I, I didn't hear him deny anything. <laughs> That's the sad part. You're gonna wake up super blue <laughs> to a freeway sign one day, and you're gonna have to talk in your regular voice. I already did. Are you and that girl uh, that you were out here with? Are you guys dating? Tabby? No, we're just friends. Oh, okay. It looked like you guys were dating. No, she's a good friend. So when, where did you learn to talk like this? What? Yeah. Probably from my parents. Where are they from? South uh, Portsmouth. It's in South UK. Have been there? But you were born and British. raised here? In Florida. <coughs> yeah. I was in um, homeschool until high school. But you can't speak with an American accent. Yeah. Do Go it. ahead, do it. Uh, <clears throat> How's this? Not bad. Right? Right? Yeah, right? <laughs> yeah, no, um, I kind of picked it up pretty quick after I got my ass kicked a few times. Shit, you know, apparently people in the South aren't very tolerant of being, about people that are different than them. Go figure, because history's always proven that differently. <laughs> I like him so much more now. <laughs> that was really good. I like that. Yeah, what a surprise. <laughs> the people who invented the KKK and lynchings aren't real tolerant of things that be different. <laughs> I'll tell you what, we ought to go stomp him. I don't know that he's a queer or nothing, but he sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's my. either English or one of them Ren Fair fags. Either way, we ought, go, we ought to kick him some ass. <laughs> I had a bit of an accent when I was a child because I grew up living with my grandparents. Now where were they from? I don't remember where my grandfather was from, but my grandmother was from... Nuki. 
where people surf. Oh, okay. It's in England. Uh, sorry, I should have just said that. They're they're from England. I know people tell me I sound like I got a southern accent. I'm like, no, I don't. <coughs> Excuse me. A little bit. I, I can see that. You could pretend. <laughs> no. You should. You ought to call everyone sugar. <laughs> sugar, I don't know what you're talking about. I haven't about. had people ask me, are you Mexican? <laughs> no, I you sound like you're Mexican. Okay. What the hell? Okay, when you say, okay, what's an, what do we call people from Mexico? He's probably not the best example because he's got an accent, supposedly. What, like what, Bex? No, what do they call? What's the, it starts with an M, ends in a kin. What's the name? Mexicans? What did you call it? Mexicans. No, you said Mexicans. <laughs> okay. That's why people think you're from the South. Because you say stuff like that. Mexicans. Yeah. Actually, Mex she said what that. No, that was afterwards. I'm oh. ignoring that. <laughs> she clearly didn't understand yeah, the question. I didn't, I didn't under Honestly, I thought that was where you were going no, too, to, to no. be honest with you. Did, you. did you, like, have... Did you date anyone for a long time from the South? Or did you no, live my whole the family's from there. Well, that's why. <laughs> just, there you go. I was born and raised here. See, this never fucking happens to Sherlock Holmes. <laughs> Everything's always a mystery to someone like, like, I don't know why he hates me. I mean, we were dating and everything went fine. Probably because you gave him eight. Yeah, it's like, mystery like, soul. Anything happened? Oh, like, oh no. I mean, he broke up with me and threw some of my shit out the window and all, but I mean, he was just a, one of them angry fuckers. I mean, I lit his dog on fire that one time <laughs> and blew up his house. And after that, that fucker was mean to me every time he saw me. And I'm just sitting there going, what? There's this fat dude came. He's this dude who wears a camouflage hat sometimes. He's big like me, looks out of shape, white guy. He's always buying alcohol, whatever. Swear to God, this guy thinks I'm his new best friend. First off, you don't well, have a penis. Well, if he's always buying alcohol, there's a you, reason for that. You don't have a penis, so you probably don't know this rule. I expect you to. If you're in the bathroom peeing, somebody walks in, they can talk. Yeah. But they don't start up a big conversation with you. Also, if there are urinals that are available... Yeah, don't get the one right go. next to them. Yeah, if there's 12 urinals available, don't stand right next to someone. <laughs> yeah. You don't want this to be happening when you're peeing. Hey, oh, yeah. your yeah. job sounds real cool. You ever get to tackle people? <laughs> you get a stun gun or a weapon or something? I bet that'd be cool. You got handcuffs? <laughs> that is not a conversation I want to have. Yeah, this creepy dude, every time he sees me... The thing is, is he's pretty big, but... And he just walks around. Like, you get that pre-rape feeling going on yes. in the back of your head. Oh, he's totally, yeah, date rape me. Yeah, he ever tells me he likes me and brings me coffee. I'm like, no, thanks. Oh, really? He's, oh, wow. His creepy, his creepy ass is telling me how cool he thinks my job is while I'm pissing. That's weird. Yeah, he I know. came, sat right, or stood right next to you? Yeah, 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 urinal, urinal right next yeah, to Yeah, no, there's, you, there's uh, plenty of space. Plenty of space. Yeah, no, there's unwritten laws about the urinal that you don't violate. Yes. That's, I never knew that. Yes, that's why I said you don't have a penis, you don't know. Girls, they sit down, they got the walls and everything. Yeah, you don't do that. The other thing is, the other day he comes walking up to me, and I look out, out the car, I look in the rear view mirror, I see nothing, I look in the window, I see nothing, boom, he's there. I don't know how he got there. He must have, like, teleported in, like, ran his fat ass across the parking lot. He looks at me, and the thing that bothers me about him, and this is what crazy people do, he starts a conversation like we've been talking for a while. Yeah, well, the thing is, she says... <laughs> it just comes in. And I'm like, through. what? Why are you talking to me? I'm going to stab you in the throat with my big pen for freaking me out. And you're telling me how you lost the love of his... He's telling me on and on about how he lost the love of his life. And I was thinking, I don't want to hear this. But then again, I'm here till one in the morning. Why not? Okay, so tell me. How'd you first meet her? Oh, it was like 15 years ago. I met her in that Sam's Club parking lot. I was living in my trailer and the lot and... She came and she was fucking some other guy in his trailer and she came over and wanted to smoke a bowl with me. Oh, and I was God. like, and I was like, damn it, that's a hallmark moment. I yeah, no, I, I, fell I, for I, yeah, no, yeah. to be honest, I think I heard that plot on that last Disney movie. Yeah. <coughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Hillary Duff is doing that next. Yeah, that's oh, yeah. going to be her. Yeah, and then he says the next part. It's like, wow, you're crazy. Then it goes on. He goes, yeah, she was almost 400 pounds then, but she's a lot slimmer now. I think it was those four years she spent in prison. But <laughs> now that she's on her meds. <laughs> oh, God. Like, are you kidding? I carry around a checklist in my head. I think most guys do of things that disqualify a chick. Like some guys won't date a girl who has kids. 
Some guys won't date someone who's been married. I think the fact that she was 400 pounds in prison for four years off her meds and smoking dope, I think that's it. Yeah. I think you pretty much could safely check that one off. Not too many regrets. You're not going to grow up to be 150 years old sitting on your deathbed thinking, well, if I was a little smarter, I might have gone with that girl back in 03 and I would have had a good life. No. <laughs> That would have been a horrible life. Yeah, you could pretty much just sort of rule her out. <sighs> I know I have a checklist about guys in my head. Oh, I'm afraid. You just told me about some guy held you up against the wall after you punched him in the mouth <laughs> and what? spit his blood on you. I'm afraid to he hear your list. my dog hella heart up in her ribs, so I punched him. And, yeah. When I was young, I was only 17, and like when you're young, you're dumb. Cool. I don't act like I don't, I haven't lost my temper since I left him. He's the only one that provoked me like that, and I won't oh. let myself get provoked. I'll walk away. You know? Good. I'm not gonna argue with you mostly because I'm afraid of you, but <laughs> <laughs> but that sounds very reasonable anyway. Does that sound reasonable to you, Bob? I tend yeah, not to punch, not to argue with anybody that's punched oh. somebody in the face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Over a dog. I mean, you know, it's like after that first time I shanked him, he was. <laughs> Things got a lot better up yeah. until that point. Yeah, it's like when you say I'm an only child, eventually. I am. <laughs> You'll get that later. What are you drinking? Are you drinking Shasta? Oh, it's Sam's Cola. Oh, Sam's Cola. How did you and Becca start talking about the uh, free candy that happened in there? There's free candy? Hold on, what? <laughs> I like candy. <laughs> I'm starting to understand how people develop those weird social phobias. I'm going to have to go back and sit in my truck. She started talking about that because you came and sat down. Oh, okay. She said she owed you a cigarette, and then she started talking about You met Becca, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. She only got two, two subject, three subjects, her, how things relate to her, and other stuff. <laughs> we don't get into the third one very often. Yeah. I thought her theories about girls are crazy was pretty interesting because she's obviously crazy. I mean, she <laughs> really is one of those chicks. Like, girls say stuff like this, and I get it. And I've said stuff like this myself, but I don't really believe it. If a dude doesn't like me, oh, it's because he's gay. <laughs> no, she says that. She means it. She really does. She, oh, does. she said that? Yeah, she does. Oh. There's a certain guy here who she had a thing for, and you probably know who it is if oh, you don't. Oh, yeah. You weren't paying attention. No, I know. Yeah, and when he didn't return her attention, she said, oh, well, look at all this. I mean, he must be gay. <laughs> she had no problem going around telling people, yeah, he's gay. I know. <laughs> like, based on what? Oh, the fact that he doesn't want to date you. <laughs> okay. But don't get me wrong. The guy could be gay. I don't really care one way or Who's the other. Guy? What? Who's the guy? I'll tell you later. Okay. <laughs> no, seriously. I mean, like, the guy could be gay. I don't know. I don't care. But let's, I don't know, dig a little deep. <laughs> like, the fact that he just doesn't want to have sex with you is not enough to say definitively, you know. I don't think that's true, though. Just because a guy don't like you doesn't mean he's gay. Yeah, I know. That's what non-crazy people think. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. She actually believes that. <laughs> 